beautiful design is all around us. In an expansive concert hall, an architectural chair, a playful typeface. We think of such things as the product of uniquely human creativity. But in fact, that design may have been engineered by an algorithm. This is Algorithmics, the space where we explore how invisible, computer-controlled, database sets of rules are making decisions for us every day. Parametric design is a process by which designers use algorithms to create the shape of an object. Give the algorithm the objectives of what your design needs, and it will generate all the different forms the object can take, while still achieving your goals. The beauty of this type of engineering is that an algorithm doesn't know or care what a typical design looks like. Unencumbered by human biases or limitations, the algorithm focuses solely on how to meet the needs of the design, and it can keep iterating to develop hundreds or even thousands of options, long after a human designer would burn out. Take the elbow chair, a piece from Autodesk's Generative Design Lab. The creators told the algorithm that the chair seat had to be 18 inches high, and had to support 300 pounds. The arms needed to be wide enough to fit the sitter's body, and they wanted the chair to be sleek, inspired by mid-century modern furniture. Beyond those parameters, the algorithm decided everything else. It offered up different geometric forms and continued refining the design to become more sleek. The creators ultimately decided on a chair that's skeletal looking, suffers little stress to its joints, and uses 18% less material than the original human-created design. Another impressive example of this algorithmic design is seen all over a concert hall in the Elbe Philharmonie in Hamburg, Germany. The auditorium features 10,000 unique acoustic panels made of gypsum fiber. Each panel, which looks sort of like a shell, has a different shape. Each of the uneven surfaces absorbs and deflects sound waves differently, and they work together to spread sound evenly across the auditorium. Other examples of parametric design can be found in medical implants, automotive parts, buildings, typography, and art installations. It's no coincidence that many of these algorithm-generated designs end up looking quite organic, like the bone chair and the shell-shaped acoustic panels. Because, after all, Mother Nature is the ultimate designer. Hey NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.